Okay, today I'm going to show you how to make this very colourful clown cake. What you need is a round and a square cake tin and using the, our cake mix, the vanilla cake mix, you make your cake. Once it's baked and you've cooled it down, you can start assembling it. What you need to do is the round we use as is to make the face and we'll use the square to cut the hat and the little bow tie. As you can see, all you need to do if you just find the halfway mark between of the square, cut it down from the center down to the one corner, as you can see, and then you do the same on the other side, and this will make your hat. What you do with the remaining pieces is cut the bow tie. All the dimensions we'll give you on the website, but basically from that piece, which, which you can see here, we take a piece off to make a bow tie. And then you mix up a um, quantity of the butter icing, which the recipe is also on the website, and you just follow those instructions in terms of tainting it with the different colors. And then assembling the cake, you start with your round in the face. Let me just, sorry, move it up. I'm going to be working closer to me. You put your hat on and then your bow tie. You may just have to fiddle with your bow tie to get the right shape, but basically they fit together like that. Now the best way, you can ice it exactly like it is, but I would suggest that once before you assemble it too close or you put it down too closely to the top, you ice this side or all the sides that are going to be closest together to the face so that you don't necessarily get any rub off, rub off of the colored icing. So once your basic cake is assembled and you've iced it, as you can see here, then you start with the little decorations. What we've used for the hair is um, little egg noodles, which we've colored with a yellow food coloring. And then you just buy various sweets resembling these shapes and you can assemble it, as you can see here. And then with these beautiful little bees, what we've used here is um, the little paper cases which you normally use for chocolates and made up the chocolates we've used the um, the chocolate cake mix you'll see the recipe on the website as well once those have baked we make up a quantity of chocolate icing and we tint the other half of the icing with yellow food coloring and then you pipe little strips of icing onto the little cupcake and you can use some licorice, which we've used here, the strips of licorice, which you can slice as the base of the eyes or the eyes. Do a little blob of ice chocolate icing to stick the silver balls. And then you can cut uh, wing shapes out of rice paper. You'll get all of this information on the website. And these are so beautiful to garnish a, ba um, a, be a beautiful ba um, party table. The children will love these bumblebee cakes. And also what a more beautiful way to dress a party table. What's also a lovely idea is to make up some party boxes that we have, little party packs that we've done here, and um, tie up some colorful ribbons. Um, also inside, good ideas for party boxes, um, little sweets and little, gay, little toys or something like that. Tie it up, present it nicely, and then put the whole lot together and you're with some balloons and the, the table looks great fun and they, they invariably have a great time.